Yeah, so uh, God, I was really lucky starting out in this business. I, I was right around 20 years old when I got my first record deal. I was signed to Capitol Records when I was 20 through my band Rigor Mortis, which we were kind of a, a for those of you who don't know, as a pioneer of the whole speed metal genre. Um, we were we didn't know what we were doing at the time. We just knew that it, we wanted to be faster and heavier than than anybody else. Um, not that we were, but we tried. You know, um, through that whole scene, I managed to meet Al Jorgensen from Ministry, and uh, his sound engineer produced my first record. And me and Al became very good friends. And I remember it was 1989, actually, when he called me and said, hey, I got this great idea of mixing your guitar with my crazy samples and, and techno sounds and, and coming up with a new sound of music. And that's kind of how the whole industrial metal thing really was evolved. Um, nobody was doing that at that time. And of course, I'm a fan of music, all music and all genres. Um, and so I was up for the idea right when he, you know, he brought it up. Um, so I, I started working with him with ministry in 1989. Rigor Mortis was still going at that time as well. Uh, the f in fact, that was the first year I did uh, the ministry tour was 1989. And, the f and I worked on a live record that year. And then right after the live record, we went in to record our landmark record, Psalm 69, which... Uh, uh, definitely spawned a lot of, of bands, man. I mean, you, you think of Nine Inch Nails, uh, to Korn, uh, that record was the one, you know, that started everything. And, uh, uh, and it's still selling. And uh, very proud of that record. That was, uh, that introduced me to playing in front of big crowds, uh, uh, getting uh, big guitars and big cars and lots of ladies and uh, lots of fun with it, you know. Um, and, uh, and we're still going, you know, 20 some odd years later. Uh, we um, just did a new, do record, uh, a new record with Ministry. Uh, it's called Relapse. It comes out in March of 2012, which will be followed up by a tour, a couple of tours, I think, I hope. Uh, and I'm doing a new Rigor Mortis record, and that's crazy because uh, even though Rigor Mortis has played uh, over the years, we, we always get together and play, whether it was once a year, twice a year, whatever, just to play. Uh, we're actually going in and doing a record for the first time in like 20 years, and uh, that is really crazy. Um, but uh, we're almost done writing it right now, and... Uh, yeah, lots of lots of great things uh, uh, to come, uh, definitely.